Hey guys, Renny with here with Off Grid Trek. Just wanted to do a quick comparison to see which of these two uh, solar generators is going to power or be powered quicker or charge quicker from two of our 200 watt solar blankets connected in series, literally in the same, um, using the same conditions in the same location. So what we have here, and by the way, it's a bit windy here, so I've, I'll do my best so you can hear me. Even though I'm wearing a mic, it's, it's still pretty darn windy. Um, so what we have here, we've got our EcoFlow Delta. That's this guy right here. We've got the Energy Flex with one battery pack, which is this one here. Uh, Energy Flex is 1,069 watt hours in that, with that configuration. And then the EcoFlow Delta is uh, 1,260 watt hours. So very similar. So let's look at the Flex here first. We've got going in 217 watts of solar to 18. Uh, just over an hour left, hour and a quarter, and 77%. And then the EcoFlow Delta, which we have right here, it is, we're at 80%, one hour left, you know, 226, yeah, we had 236 a moment ago, watts going in. Um, what, what I have seen consistently throughout the day, because I've been playing with these for about the last two to three hours, is it's about a 15 watt difference where the EcoFlow excels by... Uh, even the same conditions here, uh, there it's still uh, providing a, an additional, on average, 15 watts of power from the same solar setup. And just to point out real quick, guys, um, this is actually a good example. We're under a heavy smoke advisory here. I don't know if you can really see in the distance there, but we've got a huge amount of forest fires going on to the west, to the north of us, south of us. Uh, so a lot of a lot of bad smoke. I feel like I've got a little bit of asthma going on. But um, this is a really good example. A lot of times when you think you have beautiful blue skies, uh, you can be affected by different air quality. It could be pollution, it could be smoke from fires. But this gives a really good example of how well ours will power these devices, uh, pro power, provide power to these devices, even in you know, less than ideal conditions. But yeah, like between the two of these, um, we're, not, we're kind of comparing apples to apples, but not, not 100%. Because EcoFlow Delta is a standalone system, you can't um, you can't add additional battery packs, whereas you can with the Energy Flex. Um, the EcoFlow Delta, it, it's like the thing I love about it is it does charge extremely quick from solar, from the wall, as well as from your vehicle. Whereas the Energy Flex, now granted, this is a beta unit, unit they sent to me, so there's a chance uh, they might be updating some of this. But um, I do find that it charges not as quick. It still charges very quick, but not as quick as the Delta from, uh, from solar and not as quick from... They never sent me a vehicle charging um, like a cigarette lighter plug-in, but I would assume it's the same speed, 120 watts, um, as long as your plug is rated for that, which most vehicles are. And then from the wall, I know it does charge slower than the EcoFlow Delta, which uh, can be powered from 0 to 100% in just under two hours, which is actually pretty phenomenal that they can do that. Um, yeah, no, yeah, between the two of these, if I wanted just a straight standalone system, I would pick the EcoFlow Delta for my own personal use. However, if I wanted something that I could build, then definitely the, uh, the Energy Flex is great in that respect, because at the end of the day, just my way of thinking, I don't, I don't, I don't want to wait for something to charge it, um, especially in our interesting times right now, an extra 15, 20 minutes to charge a device. Well, there's a lot of things I could be doing with those 15 to 20 minutes. I'd rather, I'd rather have that time because time is more valuable than money. Uh, but either way, I, j I just wanted to kind of go over this and, and show everybody here. Uh, let everybody know my name's Renny. I'm the owner of the company. If anybody has any questions on any of our packages, what is available? Energy Flex, I've been told by customers that they're no longer taking orders right now. They need to catch up on their existing orders. So if you're looking for something immediately, the EcoFlow Delta is available. Uh, in fact, they just restocked the California warehouse and the warehouse in Canada as well in Ontario. Uh, this this weekend, August 1st weekend. So there is product uh, ready to ship to customers. I know we have a back backlog of orders that they're going to be filling for us. Um, but yeah, no, if you want something immediately, it's a great product to have. Energy Flex, if you're willing to wait a little bit, it's a great product to have and you can build it. Like you can, you can add up to 96 battery packs. You can add additional MPPT superchargers, which will increase the solar charging. Like literally with this configuration, I could add another MPPT solar charge controller and add another 800 watts of charging. And wow, that would be quick. But that's not going to be in everybody's budget, of course. So yeah, just wanted to give an idea. Um, again, my name's Renny. I'm the owner of the company. Any questions, let me know. Uh, give me a call. Shoot me an email. I'll do my best to uh, to call back. It's just we're super busy filling orders right now. So 
Uh, we will apologize in advance if we don't answer the phone right away, but literally everybody's buying. And on that note, I got to say this, guys, because of our interesting times, if you know you're going to buy, just, just do it. And I'm not trying to be a pushy salesperson or anything. It's just we're seeing shortages. And these shortages, I hate saying it, they're going to get worse this fall. Um, like, I'd like to be wrong on that, and I hope I am wrong, but my gut feeling is they're going to get a lot worse. So if you're, if you're wanting something for your family, just for peace of mind, for emergency preparedness, camping, what have you, it, it's best to get it now in case there is another uh, supply uh, uh, disruption in the supply chain. Okay, well, either way, uh, enjoy your weekend. Um, yeah, we've got close to 100 degrees Fahrenheit here. We're under a heavy heat warning. We've got a fire ban and lots of smoke from fires. But uh, other than that, yeah, it's a good weekend. Okay, we'll talk to you soon. Bye then.